you guys, it's your girl Cutie TV, and I'm back with another video, you guys. So shout out to our girl Captain for likes. Um, she does have a YouTube and also an Instagram, so you guys go ahead and check her out. I'm going to be playing one of her videos, but I'm not going to put the sound because I want you guys to actually go and hear the video over there where her Instagram is, so she can, you know, y'all can listen to it over there. But I will be playing uh, just the video without the audio. Okay, so you guys, let's go ahead and get started. So y'all already know about the release of Krishan Jr. We all know that the uh, Crack Rocks have put that out we discussed it in previous videos so if you guys have not seen it y'all go check that out and i did mention it in my um lives um now we have this right here you guys because there are um somebody uh decided to do a keep the toothless bandit in jail petition on change.org you guys and Captain for Like says a petition was made to keep Krishan Rock in jail in response to Superfan creating one for her release using Junior for sympathy. All right. So it says you go to this is where you go to, you guys. Um, it says Nini Renee link in bio for the petition link, you guys. Um, so a lot of people have been signing this petition, right? Um, so I'm gonna say this it's it, you know. The petition last I checked was taken down, but I, you know, I think that they put it back up. So the people said they want this to remain in jail. Okay. And meanwhile, Jaden is still making money moves like she's been doing since Blue got locked up. And also, sis was spotted, as y'all seen in my previous video, with Blueface's jewelry yet again. The same jewelry that Krishan said that she was going to get. All right. Uh, so the one thing about real MFs is they're going to speak facts and post receipts. Okay. Now, regardless of what people say, I, regardless of if it's a situation I like or don't like, I always want to see receipts. Okay. So child, they need to hang it up. Um, her, her fate lies with God and that judge. So all these crack rocks are like, Oh, well she needs to get out and stuff. Y'all, we, nobody has the decision to make that call. Okay. Only the judge and God and all those lives that, you know, lives that she did and, um they didn't do her no justice okay now blue told her to stop going live and telling her business and even when 100 told her to stop going live and telling her business stop talking about the judges stop you know saying this and that and stop talking you know this is these are the things that was told to her and she did not take heed to none of these things okay so that's okay mind you i mean it is what it is but let's be real i mean petitions are cool but Neither petition is going to determine the fate of Krishan Rock, to be honest with you. It's all about, you know, the law and it's all about what these, you know, um, law professionals decide to do with Krishan. Now, we already know that she's going to be in Venetia, uh, Venetia, I, be I believe it's called, uh, Oklahoma. Um, I don't really know much about Venetia, but I do know that from what a lot of my supporters have told me that live there, they say that it's not to be played with and they will not play with uh, people down there. So I don't know, y'all. I am wishing the best for everybody in every situation because people go through things in life. And, you know, when you're young or whatever, regardless of the fact, I just feel like at the end of the day, it needs to be a point of time to where people learn to mature and do what's right for their children and themselves. Now, this petition, you guys, it the goal was, the next goal is 200 signatures. They have already reached 176, you guys. I believe it was started on July 8th. Today is the 9th. So yes, you guys, this was just started yesterday and they're already at the 176, almost to the 200 go okay um and it was 165 people that signed the same day i believe that it was created you guys okay um so in this particular uh petition i do believe that they do have videos and in these videos you guys can go over there and see uh you know basically what these videos uh consist of you can go look at them because capital likes does play it on her instagram so you guys go over there if you want to hear that audio and um on these videos, they are basically just showing situations where Krishan was, of course, you guys know of the situation of that went very, very viral of sis having the baby bent all the way back and, 
you know, um, just so forth and so forth, right? So that is a, one of the things that actually, you know, is on the petition. And, you know, if you have like a medical professional that comes on here and sees that, they're going to look at it and be like, okay, yeah, you need to see where you're sitting at. Then there are other videos on here on the petition that people have put of not only just this with the baby, but they've also put um, videos on there of her saying she's going to get rid of the baby. She doesn't want the baby. She actually said herself that I'm going to unalive this baby when she was pregnant with him. She did say that, you guys. She said, I'm going to, you know, the K word, this baby. Um, so, you know, these videos are definitely videos that do not, um, re that cannot, you know, be pertaining to them trying to get her out of jail, right? Because when they said she's changed this, then the third day and people have came back and said, hey, no, this is the reality. Don't let somebody out because of, you know, you're, you're, you're friendly with them or they're your favorite, which I mean, come on now, petition ain't gonna get nobody out of jail. But at the end of the day, you can't sit up there and, and, and do things like, okay, well, let's let her out. We love her, you know, so, you know, you can't do things like that. So it's a lot of things that these people have put up, you know, you can't, I'm gonna be real with you, regardless of if, you know, Krishan is your fave or you don't particularly care for her as a person. That the receipts don't never lie. You know what I'm saying? The receipts don't never lie. And there's so many things, not only with Krishan, but with her family. You know, you got one of her sisters who's allegedly scammed so many of her supporters several times and tries to continue to scam so many of her supporters. So you got her and also the people around her that are just doing so many things that, you know, that don't need to be done, that are breaking so many laws. And, you know, so judges and people look at that like they take that into consideration regardless if it's something that's not going to help them make their decision they're going to look at that this stuff on social media and even when the judge was saying they said you know in a court with blue blues judge made it clear that you know they allegedly that you know she sees everything or you know on social media so these individuals these judges they you know they they look this stuff up. They may have younger children that'll kind of give them the tea or give them the whatever is going on, but they look at things like this when they're making their, you know, decisions. You know what I mean? And this is the one where she said, if you can read the screen, the letters on the screen, you know, you can see she says, I'm ready to blank this baby. You know, so she, you know, people have to think about this. Because you're looking at somebody as they're your fave, but at the end of the day, when you're sitting up there, I don't care if it's your baby, his baby, her baby. When you're sitting up there and saying those words pertaining to a child, that's a problem. It's a it, it's a it's a really really big problem, and I don't care regardless of even if you feel like you it's not in the best interest for you to keep your child, you still should be very mindful and you know of the words that you use. I mean, just you know, and she spoke herself of the many alleged, you know, um, you know, unaliving that she's done with, with the babies of getting rid of the baby. She's already, you know, been very, uh, uh, honest and forefront about that. She's been saying it a lot, but you know, again, like I said before, we already know what this young lady is capable of. If she's done it before to where she's allegedly admitted to unaliving someone. And we seen the video It's on my, it's on my TikTok. I still have the recording where she's saying that she unalived this guy. We know who the man is rest his soul. Um, you know, and she admitted to actually doing it, you know, after the fact, you know, Nobody else is exempt because I believe if somebody does unalive a person one time, they definitely will be unaliving a person again. That's just my honest opinion. And when you're around somebody like that, that is not a safe environment for anybody. No child, no, 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 nothing. That's not a safe environment, you know? And again, she says she's ready to, you know, they put the emoji, but you can go back and listen to it. I heard it from myself and she did say the K word, this baby. Um, so, you know, again, this is just something you got to really question the mind frame of a woman or a young woman that speaks like this. You know what I mean? And I get it. People say she's young. That means that has it nothing to do with anything. You know, you really got to question, um, a person like this, right? And if nobody had the receipts, nobody had the audio, if we didn't have any of this, the crack rocks would continue to lie and continue to try to sweep it up under the rug and this, that, and the third. And we just don't need to do that no more. It was a time to stop. And I think the time to stop all of that is now. The young lady is unfortunately locked up. 
Nobody wishes jail on anyone, but also nobody wishes a person to not be responsible enough to at least pay their own damn fines, okay? At least pay their own fees and everything that they're owed to prevent that jail time, okay? So anyway, you guys, that's all I have for y'all today. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one.